All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are starting year three, 300 years ago, which is the 19th level. As we can see, there is no, there are no Alta Spheres here, so I believe that this is the start of the specific character Limited Zones, which terrifies me once we get to Osmond. And I guess Goro, though I'm decent with him. But Osmond scares me. Due to Serious Force, Shao's been subbing. That's fine. <laughs> That is so fine. But it does mean that once we get the uh, end pieces, we can literally just GTFO. Which to me is pretty fucking cool. That'd be funny if this was the key. It's not the key. But that's okay. That is a fucking huge level. That is a huge level. I'm really glad I went that way though, because now I know where the exit is. And I know where oh, everything else is. Technically. Ah, oh, fucking billies. Ah, oh, they're fine. Since she one-shot stuff, I'm not really fussed. Ooh, we haven't seen a curse dancer for a bit. Yes, so good. Oh, fucking billies. Okay, I'll just wait for you to attack. How about that? Ah! Alrighty. You must be the key, because I can't progress if you're not. Very good. I'm, I'm t always terrified, not always, but I sometimes think about what it'd be like for there to be a glitch where the key's not actually placed where it needs to be, um, and I wouldn't be able to progress at all. Like, you know, I know the levels are kind of random, but I don't know if once I leave, I think it stays the same. So that'd be really fucking scary, you know? Um, I've just been scared of that this whole time because I have no means of, of um, breaking through that kind of glitch. Um, you know, playing on an emulator only has so much power to it. Uh, well, that might not fully be true with my knowledge, limited knowledge of programming as well. Ooh, what's in here? Really? We got Satan's Ring. Okay, I'm gonna just. Real quick, I'm just going to go over to this other page real quick to look at Ruby's stuff. Satan's Ring is one of Ruby's most powerful rings. It's on the same level as the Destruction Ring that we just made. I mean, let's see the difference. Let's see. The Destruction Ring turns into Morbius Ring, and Satan's... They both turn into Morbius Ring. So I, I just got her second strongest weapon. Well, one of her second strongest is the, that and the um, and the destruction ring that we made are on par. So, I mean, she's on a stick. And hey, there's the exit. So, let's just collect these things. Oh, gosh. I want to see what those... Ooh. Oh, a holy gem. That's fucking stupid. I kind of want to see what those uh, s those um... You know what? I don't care. I know we just got something really good out of a chest, but I don't care. I do not care because I want to see the end of this game. That was weird. I want to start listening to Nat King Cole. Um, James Labrie, which is the singer for Dream Theater, which is my favorite band, uh, one that gives me some of the most inspiration musically I've ever had. He often cites Nat King Cole as one of his biggest uh, vocal influences. Uh, it's Goro's turn. Uh, so I really want to give him a shot. Like, I know what his voice sounds like. I don't know much of his music, though. So I would love to, you know, be able to change that. I think it's important for any musician to know the classics, to know where things got started. Um, it's like, I don't like the Beatles but I know their music. I know I don't like them because I've listened to it, by the way. However, without the Beatles, there'd be so much that I wouldn't have musically. Black Sabbath started heavily because of the Beatles. Um, Dream Theater themselves have cited Black Sabbath and the Beatles. So it's like, oh god, that's not good. Um, I wonder if I can make it stronger. No dragon. Who did I put the diamond on? Is it on souls? Is it on shells? Might be on Gagas actually. It is. Alright, I'm 
And let's take that off as well. I don't even know what this has on here. Fucking plant, really? Shut up. Shut up. Okay. Um, do souls have anything on it that I can snag? Does this give dragon? Ooh, it does. We're gonna snag that for the time being, and I believe that. Oh, that might give damage. No, the garnet gives drag damage. That gives fire and mimic. Sorry, I, I just gotta be honest. I think I need to be as smart as I can. Ooh, ice too. Okay. And obviously we don't want to use ice against this thing because it's shooting ice at us, so it would lead one to believe that it will really don't be a don't Why you fat fuck? Eat the bread! Eat the bread! Huh. Okay, let's restock these items. Let's not fuck around with this thing. I think it's weird that you have to do it this way. But I can't... I can't just, you know... Put one in, and it... I'm not using a fucking stamina flat drink on it. I was tempted though. I almost did. No! No! Fuck off! No! You cunt! I thought I broke it again, but no, thank God for the repair powder. And of course, it didn't fucking drop, uh... The, uh... The exit item. It's locked. Bypass the trap. Success, it was poison. Disanga. Oh, that's obviously from Gaga. Let's check it out. Lightweight and easy to use fork lance. Uh, no MP at all. Curious. Good against fish. And has lightning on it. Makes sense. It's speedy, but not as speedy as the other. So that's quite a, quite a strange one, actually, in my opinion. Thought it would have, like, a full speed for being that weak. Um, well, time to test the theory if they're weak versus fire. And the theory holds pretty fucking strong. Hopefully you're not resistant to fire. I think you might be. <laughs> but that charge attack worked fucking wonders. Wow. Shit. Hence we oh, fuck off. You're gonna be the last thing I kill if I have to. All those dragons, we're gonna skip them. It's as if they think Goro's the best person for fighting dragons. Or if they just really want to give you a fucking challenge. Let's hope that something else gives us the clock hands thing. Uh, so I dropped something, I got excited. I got excited, guys. Alright, you don't scare me so much. Nothing. Don't be a mimic. Fucking creepy clowns. Alright, big box first. Last judgment. That sounds... Fuck Amethyst. I want to see where this sits on Goro's uh, list. Let's see. Last judgment. Second to last for the tall hammer. So it's a it's, uh, tier above what we're currently using. This would turn into the Satan's hammer. Axe, by the way. What am I doing? What am I doing? 125, 99. Um, well, I mean, it is a plus four with two different fucking spheres in it. So what could be cool is to... Oh, 
that looks a lot easier to build up too. Would be to um, sphere this and put it in the Last Judgment because I'd actually rather have the Tall Hammer than the Inferno. Plus, this goes directly into the Tall Hammer while this goes into the Satan's Axe, which then turns into the Inferno. So it's a tier below. Uh, so that is what I will do. Um, so yeah, as soon as this hits. Um, a level, which might be now? It's now. We're going to do that. Oopsie. Um, so. Let's actually take this stuff out. No reason wasting it. Um. Does it need anything weird to build up? Uh, mimic fish and dragon. Let's throw fish in there. Yeah, we'll just do that. Upgrade. Confirm. Status break. So this will go b above 125, so long as you know that's not its max. Um, but what's also, what will also be nice is this sphere will now be available for everyone else. I'm not going to upgrade until all these limited zones are done. Uh, so that goes to 150, so that's quite a bit stronger. Uh, we lost some fire, which is fine, but we we made quite a strong um, hammer, and it looks good too. Plus, I prefer Umgaga to have a hammer. No, where's the thing? Oh, okay. I was like, I don't have a fucking key, but I don't need a key. Yeah, I don't think he should be equipped with fire now that I think about it either. Um, let's go with no. Let's go with lightning. Let's see how that goes for a minute. Please don't be a dragon. Okay, good. Ooh, lightning's good against these fuckers. Wish it was good against the. Uh, Ooh, perfect, perfect. Let's get the fuck out. Actually, let's go get those chests. Let's... Oh! Bugger! Nah. Show me your moves! What is that from? Oh, bye-bye. Ooh, a big chest. It's locked. Guess. I guess explosion. Failed. It was a curse. Son of a bitch! It's just insulting to get something like that, because it's like, you know, we spent a lot of time working it up. Yeah, we're going to just ignore that uh, chest right there. Whoa! No! And let's get the fuck out of here. Let's get out of Dodge. Man, my cables get so freaking tangled up. Sip my tea that is... Not existent anymore. Let's go to the next floor and see who we're doing. Probably Ruby. Mm -hmm. Looks like we're going in order. Um, now let's. Uh, what are we doing here? We're going to snag that synth sphere and place it right on in here. Cause what? Why not? You know, gives all kinds of goodies to it. And I have no fear um, for her. Huh! What a bitch. I have no fear for Ruby. Before, I was quite worried. But then we got that fairy ring, and then we fucking upgraded with destruction ring, which is fantastic. Didn't we get something new for her that I didn't even pay attention to? Satan's ring, yeah, huh. Cool. Um. Build up. My heart hurts. I want to see it. Does it have like a demon? It does. It has Satan on it. That's fucking creepy. <laughs> uh, money. Let's look around the corner. Just a a heart, which we had to steal on it though, because you know uh, those things you can steal stamina drinks from. Uh, these guys are weak to wind. 
Might as well utilize their weaknesses. We've got them all. If we know what they are, might as well. Wow, 600. That's fantastic, Ruby. It's full. Um, let's take this out. Just a quick thing. We need attack. Thunder, wind, and holy dragon mimic. Thunder, wind, holy. Let's just stash a fuck ton of wind in there and see what happens. I don't believe I'll be upgrading it again. I don't. I'm not gonna grind. I don't think. Uh, so I'm pretty much just making you know as strong as I can at this point, um, with minimal effort, I should say. Alrighty. Very good. Very good. What is gonna be in this little chest here? A magical crystal, I see. Then what about here? You got me a map. That's very kind of you. Wow! Uh, I was pretty sure you're gonna block it. <laughs> come on, come on. Painful. Oh fuck! It was her weapon that needed repairing. Not uh, well, not herself. I'll say we have plenty, but we actually don't. Shit. I'm gonna need to go back uh, to the Fairy King before we do the next. Um, what the fuck? That was that was strange, wasn't it? What's happening? Maybe they're blocking. I don't know. I feel like they should take some damage while blocking because I do. Especially when you know when you're doing that much damage. Like, do fucking 10% damage. I'm complaining about a game that was made in like 2006, as if they're gonna fucking fix it. Ma Ooh, magic plus 3, that's good. I think we're MP yeah, it's already maxed though, so. Useless. Because, you know, she gains damage off of her magic, I believe, not her. Um, her attack value? I'm not really sure. Let's see what this does. Decreased fuck that from 77 or from 81 to 77. Not doing that shit. Man, give me the clock hands. It's gonna be up there with those two fuckers, ain't it? Ooh, uh, a pond. Girl looks thirsty. Do I even have the uh, back that key yet or no? Oh. Bad angle. Ooh, that was easy. I don't think I have... Oh, don't need a key. And we need wind. Fantastic. Ooh, I'm a bit close. <laughs> a bit close. Well, that was nice. It wasn't actually the key necessity. It utilized well Ruby, which is great, I think. Ah! Come on, clock hands. Yeah! Yeah, I don't have to run all the way back to the entrance. That would have been pretty bad. But yes, I'll see you guys in the next level. I need to go grab some repair powder. Probably just make you watch it, actually, now that I think about it. It's not that long, it's not like... Huh. It's not like I'm going to be fussing with uh, weapons or anything. Um, I wonder, since we're not really doing any of the story stuff, if that means that... Ten, ten's good. If that means... What am I saying? If that means we're gonna like run into story in a massive fucking sprint. Yeah, let's keep that, that cherry just in case, you know, something's hard to take out. Because that thing does stun things. Would have been great to use on the dragons, actually, uh, with Goro, but we didn't, and that's fine. Um, next should be Ungaga. Here we go. We will obviously give him the sense sphere from Goro now. So, Ruby, if you don't mind sharing a little bit, appreciate it. Customize, make him super fucking strong, sweet. Um, ice, that's neat, but let's just give him something that'll benefit him all over. Let's make sure what's on that side, too. Fuck it, let's go on this side. Might be, yeah, it's just one big room, fantastic. If 
one of these wants to maybe give me uh, the map. Ooh, a stamina drink. I'll fucking take that over a map in a heartbeat. Okay, your weakness is holy. I know that. But, oh well. You're dead anyways. Okay, and we can already leave. That is freaking brilliant. So, as soon as we find the exit, well, we're done with Ungagas. And there's the map, and there's the exit. He's thirsty? I don't care. Oh, well, there's a pond right there. I could just go drink. Yeah, I'll just do that real quick. Whoa, it's Deitch! Huh. I was worried about getting hit, but it's more so worried about... To get him away! I uh, might as well grab this chest since we're right here. Oh, the coveted potato cake! Yay! Alright, so we gotta be careful coming through here, but more so careful coming through here. Son of a bitch! Mm, not worth it. No! Those fucking pillars, man. That's what's getting me. It's those pillars. Oh, joy. Wait, what did I do? I over, overran. Out. Overshot it. That's the term. Nope. Fuck off. Nope. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that was Umgaga's uh, level. Nice and quick. Now, let's go see how Osmond's level goes. Hopefully, just as well as Umgaga's did, actually. Does that mean we're going to have a limited zone for soul or, or for tone, or no? To the next floor. Do they just assume I'm going to use tone most of the time because he's the first main character? Because I'm not. Alrighty. Umgaga. Um, Please relinquish your goods. And give them to this man here. Who severely needs them. Um, what are we doing here? Just give you some ice, I guess. And is your speed max ready? It is. Um, fuck it. MP, I guess. Make your magic a little stronger on there. And your weapon's almost broken, of course. Repair the Hexablaster. What are we fighting here? Joker? Bitch. That's decent. Does it bounce or something? Kinda curious about that. A spade is a spade! Yes, soul. A spade is a spade. D dude, come on. See, that's what I mean. Oh, it must be using its weakness. I think it's what, holding? No. What is, what are we using? Fire, okay. Oh, and it's got the gold thing on it. Very cool. I didn't know that. That's brilliant. The jokers don't like to block. It's fucking good for me. Huh. And Zoe blocks just to be like, haha, you are wrong. Attack this spade now. Fuck off. Alrighty. Osmond's level is going quite well. There's the exit. We just need. Well, let's activate on the map. We just need uh, the clock hands now. And we'll be at one of the last levels. Maybe the last level? I don't know. Revival powder! Yeah! What I'm going to do though before we go to the next zone is quick save it in case we do go to the last level. I'd rather go to the Fairy King first. You know? And we're done. Eh. Might as well finish this fucker off. God, their um their death animation sounds very different in my headphones. Like it sounds um as if someone's in my room doing something behind me. And actually, check and make sure. Yeah, no one's in my room doing anything behind me. That's good. All right, let's do a quick save just in case. Touch the clock face. And let's uh, see if this takes us to the last level or not. Leave to the next floor. Okay, it did not. 
Interesting, interesting. Wish there was a remove all button, but I don't know. Did they like not expect people to want to do that kind of thing? Um, let's get Shao out. Oh, she's not maxed out yet. Oh my gosh, she can be stronger. That's neat. That is fucking lovely. Save that. Nope. Fuck off. It's a very open level. Let's kill this blizzard and this lich. Ooh, revival powder for free. Then we'll get soul out. Snag this up, and we'll sate everyone's thirst. Because everyone has been used. Some less than others, Ungaga. <laughs> that was nice and quick. I really en enjoyed that one. And Gorb got his ass handed to him, forget. Eh, let's just keep Tone out for the time being, because it looks like we're back to getting Altaspheres. And there's a fire attachment. Don't really care for that. And there is a key to a door, which is right here. Thank you very kindly. Uh, thank you kindly game. Now, would you kindly... Oh, brainwashing! Get it? Bioshock, get it? Yeah. Ooh, fantastic power powder. Um, obviously, we will be using the last of our power powders. Um, fuck, 1,500 damage before we actually take on the last boss. It'd be idiotic not to. You know, be as powerful as we possibly can. Angel Gear is full. Take that off. Um. Are we even seeing any beasts? Let's fucking put. Do I have any holy? I think I have holy on another weapon. Oh yeah, I got another lamp sword. That's fucking annoying. Did I sell the weapon that the holy is resting on? I think I might have actually. That times two. That pisses me off. <laughs> I want it on the current weapon, but I'm not like constantly upgrading. Do I seriously not have holy? Satan's ring would be funny if it had holy on it. It might, who knows. But shit on you guys, I know that. No, fucking equip. Oh, not that it matters, but whatever, we'll do that. I don't know. Oh, what am I doing? What am I doing? Soul, get your shit together. Here, let's put fucking stone on it. We fight golems sometimes. Upgrade! Mm, put this back on for the lulls of it all. <sighs> oh, shoot, almost stepped right on it. I didn't even get close. Monsters pump with energy. They can fuck right off with that idea. And let's snag this alt sphere. Sand glass. The fuck is sand glass? And I know, you know, sand with intense heat, like a lightning bolt turns into glass, but the fuck is sand glass? I believe that's the uh, F U to to weapon endurance. Don't really remember. Very good. Found the exit. Very good. Fucking don't like these Alexanders. There's a bug in my room. Go away. It's just like a little gnat, though, like a little fly, so not too fussed about it. Oh, good, this is one for Xiao. It's worried I might have to bring out, uh, Osmond. I mean, I was... Oh, fucking ate my eye. Did you really fly my eye, bug? Son of a bitch. Did. Alright, got it. I wonder why bugs fly in your eye. I wonder if, like, they're attracting maybe the moisture that resides within. Hey, there's our exit, but we do need all the Atmelia. Nope. Is there something behind me? No? Okay. Thought I saw something else in here. We got a magic crystal right away. That's good. And a holy gem. That's fucking useless. And we kill these things so quickly, it seems silly to not just kill it now. Considering we're using Xiao. Um, back across. It looks like we have one, two, three more Alta Spheres. Those might be the last three of the game don't actually know, but I think this is the 24th 
Yeah, this is the 24th level. I just looked in the top corner. <laughs> oh, I'm so smart. I'm so attentive. It's It just amazes me sometimes how attentive I really am. I mean, wow. <sighs> the prophet of time, perhaps? Oh, I want to go play Chrono Cross again. I might actually just do that. Um, you know, just like in my off time, play Chrono Cross again. I haven't played it for a year? When did I start my channel? That hasn't been a year. Has it? I don't know. Regardless, I'm at like 42 subs right now, which for me is bananas. I remember when I was at 15, I was like, oh, this is fucking great. <laughs> and then I got up to like 30, I was like, oh, this is pretty fucking cool. And then I got up to 40, and I was like, hell yeah. And then I got to 41, and then I got to 42, and I'm just like, it feels amazing. That just keeps fucking growing. Yeah, 42. That's small. I know. That's fine. I don't care. But it's just really fucking cool for me. You know, it feels great to know that people actually watch this shit. A lich. Revival powder, fantastic. That's a good way to hit some of the last enemies in this game. You might hear claps soon, too, because I'm going to try to kill this other gnat that's fucking flying around like a little dick. He's going to go for my eyeball. I know it. I just know it. He's going to be like, Kamikaze! Book of Curses. All right. Possibly the last two chests in the game. Gay. They really like ice, don't they? Oh well, that's fine. So, what I'm thinking to do is go into that uh, pond shrine thingy, whatever it's called in this level, in this area called, and just doing this. Get everyone, make sure everyone's healed up and and uh, thirsts are, are sated, so there are no sudden surprises, you know. Worst thing, well, not the worst thing, but it'd be annoying to be fighting the last boss and be like, You're thirsty! Be like, what? Fuck cares. So, what I'm gonna do here is. Well, first, I'm gonna put the clock hands in. And damn! For those who break the command commandments, only those who know the truth can. What? Okay. Did I miss something in here? No. So let's leave dungeon? For those who break the commandments, only those who know the truth can go beyond the final gate. Anyway, I'm going to call the episode here. Thanks everyone for watching. In the next episode, we will break the commandments and go beyond the final gate. Thank you all for watching. This is almost it. I'm very excited. I'll see you in the next episode. Take care.